there's fireflies all over here. They're absolutely fantastic, look. And these aren't, aren't of course, flies. They're little beetles, and they emit this cold greenish glow from a special organ on the underside of their abdomen. I do remember a book I had when I was a kid saying that you could read a book if you had enough fireflies or glowworms in a jar. First, ah. he has to catch them. Oh, ah. <laughs> Don't lose them. And I reckon I've got about 50 fireflies in here. At least 50. And we've got them in the jar. Oh, wow. That is just fabulous. Let me see. You put off your light. Let's see if we can do this. It's like a little disco show. Around the world in 80 days. I think you would ruin your eyesight. But George's night shift has not been in vain. He's proven one thing for sure. This is a very special place. It does seem to be incredibly rich. And it's these armies of small insects that feed birds and other animals, which in turn feed the higher carnivores, including cats. I know the word pristine is often used, but in this regard, uh, I think for this forest, it really is accurate. 